Um, Donald Trump is the greatest con man who ever lived, and I want to dress like him when I grow up. Yeah, so, like, I had to pay, uh, I'm sure, I had to pay money in taxes this year, and I'm sure there are people who will be like, well, I bet you probably paid, like, more than Donald Trump did. And here's the thing, that does not make me hate Donald Trump. That makes me want his tax guy so that I cannot pay taxes. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, for real. Uh, I'm relatable. This isn't the right oh, so that just means you didn't pay any personal taxes. One is businesses have all been paying taxes the whole time. Man, and that won't be reported on his personal tax, right? Is that how that works? I don't know. No I'm, one knows. I'm how, not a tax no guy. one really knows how taxes work. Um, not even the CPAs that are professionally paid to do our taxes for us. They just you know throw a bunch of numbers into a generator, and be like, oh, this looks right. Yeah. Let me see something. Let me. See. I've, I've heard um, something about. About Trump, but I, I haven't verified if it's true. Let's see if I can do a quick Smash verification. Smash the other one. Okay. It worked. Mario, you did it, you beautiful little Italian. Business is the worst word because it's not spelled right. Business. Oh, you drained. Oh, oh I forgot to drain all the yeah, water. Yeah, you gotta drain the moat in order to get the invisible. Here we go. Yeah, this thing. You remember, Dylan? You get all staticky? Yeah. Oh, you died. It's fine. It's fine. Go, cool, Mario. Oh, that's right. Never mind. They kill through me. I don't like what the camera's doing right now, though. It's a great bird's eye view, man. What do you mean? It's a little too much for me. Not gonna lie. Uh, there's just some coins or something. I want an no star. We're fine. Mario. It's always about the stars with you. Why can't it ever just be about the coins, Nico? Some people have to make a living, and Mario. Oh no! Mario! Mario, <laughs> Mario makes his by stealing the coins he finds around various locations. Mario, you beautiful little bastard. Yeah, for whatever reason, when you said that, there was a clip from Robot Chicken that popped in my head. Oh, you That's love cool. Robot Chicken, Dylan. Dude, I. You loved Robot Chicken as a little boy who was far too young to watch Robot Chicken. Yeah, unfortunately, so. I. You watched, you watched an awful lot of things that you were way too young to watch. Yeah, uh. Robot Chicken was definitely one of them. Uh, I also watched Family Guy. Did not like American Dad. American Dad is much better now. Oh, yeah. Uh, American Dad is significantly better than Family Guy. Yeah, uh. What else did I watch? Uh, my mom told me not to watch Ed and Eddie because she actually legitimately thought it made me dumb. Uh, That's what my mom thought too. Yeah. So uh, also I of... brought it up with her recently. She's like, "Yeah, like I actually thought the show was making you dumb." I'm like, "That's that's love, mom. I guess thanks." It's supposed to, you know, not. You refused to get potty trained. I believed it was because of the funny Ed boys. <laughs> I don't know what else I would have watched when I was a kid that would have been bad for you. Know. Right, we're going through. Robot Chicken is definitely. You watched like a bunch of horror movies or something like that. Yeah, I watched. How was it? Lake Placid and Deep Blue Sea. Yeah. Uh, you watched Chucky, which is why you are scared of uh, dolls and uh, mannequins. You're and actually stuff. not wrong there. That yeah. is legitimately why. Yeah. Mm. Uh, okay. Else? Yeah. So. Yeah, it is what I, I had believed. So. Oh, a, lot people, about... a lot of people like to talk about how many like businesses Trump has made that like have failed or whatever. Yeah, and say uh -oh. he's a bad businessman. It looks like it's about uh, 19 total businesses. Uh, Trump has started about 500 businesses. Oh. Uh, I believe it's something like 30% of all businesses fail within their first five years. It's something crazy like that. Uh, based on these numbers, he has a success rate of... 99.9 something percent. <laughs> it's yeah. just a, it's just an outright lie to know to say he's not at least somewhat skilled at business. Tanner, you better be careful. You guys Smith. talked about this at some point. What? What? It's like one sure. of your Spider Spider Man. Videos, we, we've talked. We, you know, we've talked. We've talked about Trump quite a bit. <laughs> Do you think we're gonna get le like we're gonna grow faster or slower now that Trump's out of office? Um. Oh no! Our content wasn't all that dependent on him, but we we're, we're definitely we're definitely coming from a much more unique perspective than most other YouTubers regarding him. Yeah, probably. Dylan hates Trump, though. Yeah. Dylan. How do you go from Trump. saying I? Hold on a second. <laughs> it's, so a love, it's a love-hate relationship. He loves the mysticism, but he hates the man. 
I feel like I'm the content magnet right now. You just throw things at me and hope that they stick. That's that's why we bring people on. We need to just bounce lies off of them. Uh, yeah. Dylan was at the Capitol on January 6th. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan actually is the guy in the Buffalo... Uh, the Buffalo... What? Hat? Buffalo Bill hat. Yeah, the Buffalo Bill hat. He, he tucks his penis in between his legs <laughs> and asks women if they fuck him. Would well, you fuck me? I'd, I'd fuck me. <laughs> It puts, it puts the lotion on its skin, or else it gets the hose again. Dylan, have you seen Silence of the Lambs? No. You haven't? Uh, it's a great movie. Yeah, don't you check out Silence of the Lambs. It's a great comedy. check out Silence of the Lambs. Uh, hold on put, on your, uh, put on your uh, anime to watch list. Yeah. Right. Anime? No, it's not anime. What would you say? What was Silence it? Silence of the Lambs. It's got like a cool picture of uh, oh. like the covers of Whammon with a butterfly on her face. Yeah. What is this? Movie? That plays a very small part in the movie too. <laughs> but it's quintessential to mm -hmm. the frame banner. Don't watch any of the sequels though. Yeah. What the hell? Wait, what? What? what what's up? What is this movie about? I don't think I want to watch this movie. It's a, it's a, but it's listen, a documentary. It's a, it's a classic. Like yeah. it's, a, it's actually a cinematic classic. Yeah, like Schindler's List or yeah, uh... it's, it's up. It's one of the greats. Where and like I know, it, I feel like my tone of voice does not communicate this. I am being, <laughs> I am being. He's entirely genuine with you right now. Yeah, I'm being 100 percent truthful here. This is like a must see movie. Yeah, much like Groundhog Day. Gotcha. No, well. Groundhog Day is pretty cool. Tanner hates it, but yeah, I hate he hates Bill Murray. I hate Groundhog. Well, yeah, Bill Murray is the only reason we didn't get good Ghostbuster sequels. Yeah. Um, <laughs> That's the only reason. The only reason. Yes. Tanner was a big fan of the Lamb. Mm -hmm. Tanner loves women. Don't yes, you? I'm a big fan of women. Um, but yeah, we're, we're, I think it's on Netflix, so you should watch it today. Yeah, you should watch it today, Dylan. You should watch gotcha. it today, and then next week you can, re you can report to us what you thought of it. Gotcha. I'll, I'll do that. My favorite part is the part where, where the, the one prisoner throws jizz at the main character's face. Yeah! <laughs> You're about to run out of lives. What, what, what happens if that happens? Uh, if I run out of lives, uh, Mario says, Game over! And that's it. That's all that happens. That, that's your punishment. Mario, the, Mario says game over. <laughs> I'd be disappointed. Mario's my dad. Um... Alright, Tanner, hypothetical question for you. Okay. I, I'm gonna need to strap in as well, because this is gonna be a long one for okay. you, okay? Alright, so... Like, like it's gonna take you a while to say it, or it'll take me a while to think about it? Yeah, it'll take me a while to say it, as well as you to think about it. Gotcha. Because this is like a real moral Ooh. dilemma for you. Okay. Alright, so... Uh, you're just kind of perusing Reddit one day, as you tend to do. Yeah. Uh, and you and you see uh, the mildly interesting subreddit ha has a little has a little uh, like a little message going on. Yeah. And, and it, typically you just kind of ignore these like sort of text posts. You're all about them pictures. Mm-hmm. Uh, but this time. Uh, I'm much like a rabbit. Yeah. I'm very visually. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Keep going. Something about it kind of sparks your interest mm -hmm. as you see these words that state that. Uh, they have found a, a little... I like how you combined piques your interest with sparks your curiosity. Yeah. <laughs> and so that's completely unintelligible. Uh, the person says that they have found a neat little Easter egg in the uh, Nostalgia Critic videos, okay? Is this just going to be something stupid where it's like, but you're in the videos, what do you do? No, of course not. Is what a lot of your hype No, 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 of are. course not. Of course not. Kind of. But there's more to it than that. <laughs> Alright, so Tanner. Mm -hmm. uh, you see... That, uh, as they're describing what's going on, they state that, uh, they, they found that in every single episode of the Nostalgia Critic, that there's a single frame where you can see the visage of a, some strange man yeah. who, who no one knows. Yeah. And as you look at these images, Tanner, mm -hmm. you suddenly start to realize that it's you. Wow. You are in the Nostalgia Critic videos, Tanner. Why are so many of your hypotheticals like this? And so, Tanner, so, you call up Doug Walker himself. To get to the bottom is of that, this. Is that the Nostalgia Critic's real name? Yes, his name is Doug Walker. And Tanner, as, as you were speaking to him, he says, Oh, Tanner Nickel, I, I, I never thought you'd find this. Uh, it, here's my address. I, I would like you to come visit me. I, I have something important I need to discuss with you. Okay. So you come and discuss it with Doug Walker, okay? okay. You, you go to his home. Just like <laughs> against, against your better judgment, you go to his very own home in San Francisco, Oregon. And, uh, San Francisco, yeah, Oregon. Yeah, San Francisco, Oregon. And uh, as you're speaking to him, he reveals to you 
that he is your son from the future, Tanner. Crazy. And he has come back in time to learn about the father he never got to know growing up. Uh-huh. Because you abandoned him mm. after dying tragically. <laughs> that's not, that's not abandonment. <laughs> sure that's the way he sees it. So Tanner, he stretches out his arms and says, Papa, my real name is not Doug Walker. It's Lazarus Nikolai. <laughs> Ooh, Please boy. let me know you, <laughs> Tanner. Do you, do you get to know the nostalgia critic? No. As your as your okay. son. This man's clearly insane. <laughs> I pro I I, I yeah, you know uh I'd probably call the police. <laughs> You'd call the police on your own flesh and blood, Tanner. Yeah, yeah, because you know time travel isn't real. <laughs> it apparently is though. But it's not apparently is. <laughs> I, I'd much sooner jump to the conclusion that this man is either pranking me or an insane. <laughs> Alright, that's fair. That's fair, Tanner. Mm -hmm. Alright. Well, you're right about taking a long time for you to get out. Check this out. Check this out, Dylan. Do you remember this? Do you remember this, Dylan? Not yet. <laughs> I was talking to this, to this girl yesterday about, like, like religion and philosophy and whatever. Yeah, of course. And I, I slowly come to discover that she's based all of her religious and philosophical beliefs off of YouTube videos. Nice, nice. It's it's just, it's a lot of stuff that doesn't make any sense, and, and it, like, it's, like, easily argued against and whatever. Oh, <laughs> but, um... Yeah, go on. Like, what, 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 what... It was stuff like, uh... She thinks all souls go to the same, like like good play, like a good afterlife or whatever I'm yeah like, all right, so what's but she also believes in reincarnation I'm like what's the point in well it's like the movie soul Tanner well, it's, but and then she's also like and also uh, well, I was like what's the point of reincarnating it's like because every soul has like has like a mission needs to accomplish I'm like okay what's so once they accomplish the mission they, they stop reincarnating and she's like nah you, you stop reincarnating what do you want I'm like oh well, so like, if you can just stop reincarnating, what if you don't finish the mission? Like, what's the point in having a mission if, regardless of if you finish the mission or not, you go to the good place? And basically, over the span of like an hour, I kind of dismantled everything she believed in because none of it made sense. Why would you do that to her, Tanner? I I thought you loved this woman. I don't love her. I hope she doesn't watch this, because he's not going to like that. But. Nico, I'm going to re be real. That's most of society, though. Damn. Tanner loves them. Tanner that's loves most, most of society. Most of society, their, their, their beliefs just don't make any goddamn sense. Go do the thing. What is there we go. Indian? That's how Mario sounds. That is not how Indian... <laughs> what, like, do you mean Indians like Native Americans? No. Like, it doesn't matter one way or the other. It doesn't sound anything like it, but... That's what it sounded like to me. Oh, Dylan. Oh, Dylan. There's uh, one. I feel like there's supposed to be one more red coin here. There were three. Did you yeah. get three? No, I only got two. Dylan's a racist. One of these are not coming up. I am not racist. Dylan can't be racist. Can't He's be black, racist. Dylan. Damn, you're right. <laughs> Go yeah. up. I really... I found it really funny. Haha, uh, how funny. I think we already talked about this, but, like, last week how... There, there was a march about, like, ending Boy. white supremacy against, like, Asian Americans. Yes. And the reason they did because there were a bunch of attacks against Asian Americans around the country, like, all in the same week. Yeah. But the problem is, in all of the attacks, the people attacking those Asian people were black people. So they did a march against white supremacy because a bunch of Asians got attacked by black people. <laughs> uh, it's just, just... Like, Epic? Is that what the word you're looking it's for? Non it's nonsense. They could, like, <laughs> if you want, like, all they could, they, they could have just done a uh, stop anti-Asian racism and it would have been fine. No one would have asked any question, but instead you decided to do that. And, and now you look like fools. <laughs> but they don't feel like fools, Tanner. That's the thing. That's, yeah, that's probably the biggest problem. They don't feel like fools. I swear there's one more red coin. Where apparently is it? not. You apparently don't. <laughs> Dylan saw it too. <laughs> You apparently don't remember where any of the red coins are. There's only one more. Why does this always happen on every like, level? Is it outside? I don't think it so. Is happening I'm pretty sure they're all supposed level. to be. Oh, there it, it is. is. You had to get the piano to move. Um, you. I thought that was the case, but I didn't see it before. I honestly forgot about the piano. I had no idea what you were talking about. <laughs> He's a funny man. Where did it go? 
absolute mad lad. I love the piano. Tanner's favorite part of this game is the piano. And like, you know, after after like fucking dude. I wanna like, see if I can uh, buy after like five episodes or twenty-five stars? That's crazy. Bro. Average five Come on. stars an episode, dude. Come on. It's not that bad, right? It's not that bad. Not that bad. Why you it's not that bad. <laughs> oh boy, Mario sure is cool, everybody. He has a mustache, but it's different from his hair color. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.